Hi everybody, my name is Muhammad Ahmad. I'm PhD student at the University of Buckingham School of Computing. My talk title is an uh, INAS-based approach for constructing deep learning models for breast cancer recognition from ultrasound images. Uh, most of the handicraft CNN architecture are designed for uh, natural image classification, for example, AlexNet, VGGNet, and GoogleNet. So designing uh, an architecture for your data set manually, it takes time and it needs more experience because you have to fine tune all of this manually, all of the hyperparameters manually. Uh, then instead of that, there's another technique which is called NAS. NAS automatically searching for a uh, good architecture for your data set uh, by using RNN as a controller to generate a CNN architecture and reinforcement learning to improve the uh, controller's generation. Then the following up method is efficient neural architecture set, which is ENAS, and ENAS is more efficient than, ENA, uh, than NAS. Uh, the aim of this study to investigate the effectiveness of ENAS for breast cancer recognition from ultrasound image. In this study, we adapted my uh, microsearch space of ENAS, which is uh, it's a first time using for uh, design CNN architecture for breast cancer classification from ultrasound image. Uh, microsearch, uh, it's searching for cell instead of searching for entire uh, network. Then uh, uh, in each searching, uh, generate two type of cells, normal cell and reduction cell. Reduction cell using for dimensionality reduction by using stride two. Uh, then uh, uh, we can divide it by two parts. The first part calling searching stage. In the searching stage, uh, the controller generate or searching for an optimal cells. Then stack these cells uh, together uh, to design the final architecture and the final architecture will generate uh, by uh, or designed by stacking these uh, the, a set of these cells then trained from scratch in our study we uh, use it uh, our data set and we resize the, uh, the size uh, of image as 100 by 100 and bat size 8 and uh, other are hyperparameters set as a default of uh, ENAS. So then the controller searched for 150 epoch in each epoch generating uh, 10 architecture. Then we selected these two optimal as a, our optimal uh, cell for all architecture. Then by stacking these cells, we designed two architectures. Uh, which is the first one, INAS 17 and INAS 7. Uh, INAS 17 consists of 17 cells or 17 layers as showing here five normal, normal cell and one reduction and so on. And the seven one uh, consists of seven uh, cells and we uh, train this, uh, these two architectures from scratch and we use it uh, five cross validation. In this study, we used our ultrasound image for breast lesson, which is, consists of two classes. Its class consists of 262 images, and the region of interest manually cropped by radiology, and we use it uh, two technique of data augmentation for expand our uh, training set. Then the table showing the performance of our model on uh, breast cancer classification, and also we compared our model with two. Uh, existing model which is manually or handicrafted designed for uh, image classification. The first one AlexNet designed for natural image classification and the second one CNN3 designed for ultrasound uh, breast cancer classification. We train these two from scratch on our data set and this is the performance or average performance of five fold cross validation and the results show it that uh, accuracy and uh, true negative uh, true positive right uh, of our both CN uh, automatically designed architecture better perform than the two handcrafted designed architecture on ultrasound image classification and also number of parameters in AlexNet more than number of parameters in our INAS uh, designed architecture. We investigate the efficacy of INAS approach for designing CNN architecture for breast cancer classification. And uh, demonstrated that the uh, INAS technique reduced human interventions in CNN architectures design. Also, the optimized architecture leads to more accurate uh, than the handcrafted uh, architectures for breast cancer classification. Uh, in the future, we will evaluate our INAS model on external data set from different source and we use uh, INAS to generate a CNN architecture for um, different type of cancer from ultrasound.